Hello everyone, this is Lily, and today I'm going to be playing Minecraft. I This is my first time ever recording Minecraft on my channel, and I'm very excited to do it. And so, today's my first time. But it's not my first time on Minecraft, since I play Minecraft a lot, and I think I'm pretty good at it. So, today we're going to be playing a survival world, and it has cheats off, so if I die, then I'll lose all my stuff. Which I'm not particularly excited for, but I'll live with it. And now, I'm just going to load into the world, and let's begin. You might notice that I'm playing on an iPad and not a computer, since I'm a little... I'm not on my computer right now, since it's charging, and I probably shouldn't look at it that much. So, let's begin. It's generating world now, and it should start. Yay! If you want to know what my skin looks like, this is what it looks like. So, let's begin. Right now, I'm just going to start off by getting some food and wool so I can make a bed and I won't starve to death. Little sheepies. <laughs> See, if you haven't played Minecraft before, pretty much it's a game. It used to be called, I think, like, Cave Game or something. And it's pretty much a game where you have to survive um, in survival, um, survival mode and... And pretty much you can't die from zombies and skeletons. And you can also go mining to get better armor and tools and stuff. But since Minecraft's a really complex game, it's hard to describe all of it. So that's pretty much a simple explanation, I'll tell you. Oh, it looks like we're in a uh, mushroom biome. And hopefully, maybe we'll find some mushrooms. So right now, sorry if the sound is a little... Yeah, we did find mushrooms. Hi, little guys. Sorry, wait. Do mushrooms turn leather? Yeah, I think they're just like normal cows, except you can get mushroom stew with them. So, pretty much those are mushrooms. <laughs> they look very weird, and they're pretty much a playoff of cows, except they're like mushroom cows. That's why they're called mushrooms. So now I think I'm going to try and collect the... Wait, I wanna, I don't think I get, yeah, I don't, but I get mushrooms whenever I break this, so I'm just going to get some mushrooms, because why not? I don't get mushrooms when I break the top part, so I'm just going to take these three and run. So I should probably try, um, make my way out of this biome so I can cut down some trees and stuff, because um, I need to make shelter or in the darkness, um, who knows, I might not be able to sleep because I'm not allowed to go to bed if there's monsters nearby. And also, I don't want to get attacked by monsters in the nighttime. So I'm going to make this a shelter. I'm going to try and make it near the mushroom biome because the mushroom biome is sort of rare and it's a nice biome to be near. There's only a few trees over here, but I'll just collect them just to be near the mushroom. So it, it might be a little, you might get a little impatient just watching me break this wood, but uh, luckily it doesn't take that long. Thank you, Minecraft, for not making it take an hour to cut down a tree. And also, unlike real life, you can literally break logs that are, like, really high above you, and you don't need an axe or anything to break them. But an axe, if you make it in Minecraft, it makes it a lot faster. Oh my god, there's a lot of biomes over here. Right now I see a... Um, a desert biome. There's not many trees. But I'm going to make some food because I'm, I can't sprint anymore. Since, oh, look, a baby mushroom. Since I can't sprint anymore because um, I don't have enough food. So Minecraft's similar to real life if you've never heard of it before. It's, But it still has a lot of different things. Like, for example, um, let's see over here. Um, if you break the block below this dirt block, the dirt block isn't going to fall. <laughs> and in real life, it definitely would, unless gravity is acting really weird. And you see there's a lot of flowers. Maybe I'll collect the flowers, but right now I'm just focused on trying to find trees because it's getting closer to nighttime now, and um, I only have eight pieces of wood. Oh, look, three horses. But there, there's a lot of cool biomes, but I see no trees except for that one tree that I broke. So annoying. 
How am I gonna get wood now? And I need wood for a lot of things other than a house. I could use dirt to make a house for now, but I but I need wood for other things like swords and stuff. Pretty much for short, you can't live in Minecraft without some wood. <laughs> and I'm also running out of food, so I'm gonna need to um, make a furnace soon and go mining. And I can't go mining without wood. <laughs> I need some clay, why not gather some? With clay you can make bricks, and with bricks you can make flower pots and brick blocks. But brick blocks are very hard to make because they require a lot of clay. Oh no! Well, there goes the clay that I was mining. Oh well. Oh, I'm gonna get some of this. With um, with this you can make sugar, and you can with um, with I can't remember what these called. What these are called? I think sugar cane. Yeah, sugar cane. With sugar cane you can make sugar, and then you can also make paper. And paper is used for like books and stuff. And here are lots of cactuses. I, sometimes I would collect a cactus. Here, I'll collect one cactus just in case I ever make a base and I want to put a cactus in it. But unless you want to like hurt your friends or something and they're playing with you, you don't really need cactuses. Oh, I'm gonna break some of these dead bushes because sometimes they can drop sticks. Yep. Um, and and that's a free way to get wood without having to cut down trees because I can't find any trees around here. See, I already have six sticks just from breaking down some of those dead saplings. Oh, look, some sand bunnies. See that? They get scared very easily, but they're really cute. Can I look back? So I'm just collecting a lot of these dead bushes, just in case I, I'm not going to find any trees at all. Okay. So now that I have lots of sticks, it's and you keep on going and and trying and try to find trees. But of course, you can never have too many sticks. So I'm just collecting some dead bushes on the way. Oh, it's a cave. Is there lava? Yeah, there's lava. I don't really need lava either right now. It is useful instead of coal, but I don't have an iron bucket, so I can't um, use it. But it smells a lot of things. If you get just a bucket of lava. You can smell um, a lot of um, a lot of things. I think I'm like forty. While like one piece of coal can only smell like two things. So they're very useful. Okay, now I think I am starting to have too many sticks. So I now that I have twenty three sticks. I'm just gonna keep on going and not stop. Because you, as you can see, the sun is already going down in Minecraft. Oh look, I see some trees in the distance. Can you see them too? probably can and also I don't want this video to get too long so soon I am going to have to stop the video but not yet trees oh no I can't kind of reach the trees all the zombies and creepers are and skeletons and stuff are already going to start spawning and spiders oh no let's try and reach them before it's too late oh my god a witch oh my god two witches what am I going to do Keep inventory isn't on, so I'm so I'm in some trouble. See, maybe I'll take it now I just ate all the food I have, so I can hopefully regen health. Oh no, I think I'm gonna have to hide in the caves tonight. So now that we did that, I'm gonna make a crafting table, and let's make some wood. So I'm going to make a wooden sword and a pickaxe. Oh, I'm also going to make a bed. Okay. So now that I have the bed, I'm just going to sleep tonight. You can't place a wood on the bed and stuff. Okay, you can't. Okay, now that it's morning, I won't have to worry about mobs as much since um, most mobs burn in daylight. So now that I'm ready, I think I'm going to collect some coal and then uh, make some torches and, and smelt some stuff so that I can make a home and possibly even go mining. 
Sadly, there's no coal here, so I'm going to have to go to the next cave. Oh, look, chicken. If I smell the raw chicken, I can, um, it'll, um, make some good food. But I shouldn't eat it alone, because if I do, then I have a chance of getting poisoned. Oh, no, no! Not a creeper. Die! Look! Oh. Ooh, and a creeper may have even led me to a good cave. Also, sorry if you can't see. I'm having trouble seeing, too. It's just I can't find any coal. So, I don't know where... Um, so I can't make torches. Because to make torches, you need coal. And I don't have any coal. Hmm. And I'm searching for coal now, so that hopefully we can see. So it'll help you see, me see, and pretty much everyone see. Oh, look, llama. Don't spit at me, llama. <laughs> and a horse. Okay. Some iron. But I can't mine iron if I don't have a stone pickaxe. Then I'm going to quickly make a stone pickaxe. Because iron, although it's not coal, it'll be very useful right now. Hmm. Okay, now that I have a stone pickaxe, I'm going to make a stone axe too. I can start... Oh, I can start mining. There's some more iron. There's a lot of iron in here, but no coal. <laughs> iron heaven! So that was a lot of iron. So where's the iron that I found before? Okay, here it is, everyone. Just need to check that it's still recording. But I'm afraid I have to stop this video here. So once I finish mining all this iron, I will have to stop this video. But um, there will be a part two, I promise. And don't worry, I won't do anything off camera, I don't think. So that's it. Bye! This is Kitty Love Love Kitty. Hey!